it's breast cancer or another form of cancer, the disease touches so many of us so differently. And as the Now Buffalo's Ali Tui reveals in this case, it also is bringing two strangers together. Nancy Hicks isn't afraid to get her hands dirty. I love mother nature. The 60 year old from Asheville loves gardening and soon she'll have a new ornament for her garden. I'm sorry. It does. It does. It gets me every time. It touched me in a way that I can't even explain. To understand why Nancy's so moved by this rock, Kenzie, come. You have to understand her past. It was in 2001, so it's been 16 years now. When Nancy was diagnosed with breast cancer. I think it'll always be a part of my life. And today? Thank God I'm cancer free. Enter Teresa Robel. She and Nancy were strangers until last month, but both know the pain cancer can cause. I lost my father to liver cancer in 2010. Teresa's part of Sweet Buffalo Rocks, a group that paints rocks and leaves them for others to find. Just wanted to put inspiration out there to people. Teresa is the artist behind the Hope Rock. She designed it in honor of October, which is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. To do something good and have it bring meaning to somebody, just it made my day. Nancy had been shopping at Kohl's when someone left it nearby. When Nancy got back to her car, that's actually when she discovered the rock. It had been left next to her driver's side tire. I'll get emotional how touched I was that it was regarding breast cancer. Nancy hadn't heard of Sweet Buffalo Rocks before. High five. Good girl. Sit. And now she'll never forget it. That rock means a lot to me, and that rock will go in my garden and forever be a reminder of that day. For the Now Buffalo. I was incredibly touched. I'm Allie Tuwee.